I just feel like a total whirlwind of just ugh, and I don't know why. Good morning, internet friends. How are we doing today? Hi, we sassy. Are you doing good? Here we are, Yeah, I want the toy that my brother had instead of listening to mama. How are we doing, Riddler? I want the windowsill. I don't even know why you guys are sniffing at that. Hey, leave it. Why are you sniffing at the window? Anyway, um... I'm not doing very good mentally this morning, and I'm not really sure why. Um, I think it's just like one of those times, and this happens a lot, and I think a lot of you guys can relate too, where like all of a sudden everything that you've been anxious about just hits you at once. Like, so I dropped off my brother because he's doing a speech for Special Olympics with the Kiwanis Club, which is awesome. Go Tyler. And just... All at once, my brain was like, hey, you know what? You need to go to the doctor at some point. You need to figure out what's going on with you. But you might just be crazy because you don't really have hypothyroidism. You're just fat and lazy. And, um, oh, and while we're on that, finances, you need to be, save more money and not be such a, not be so horrible about your money. And then there's getting a job. Yeah, that wonderful time of getting a full-time job. Oh, well, thank you, buddy. Are you doing pressure for Mama? Yeah. Can you stay right there? I appreciate it so much. And then there's getting a fight. And then trying to get a full-time job. You have your part-time job, but you need a full-time job. And what about going to getting your master's degree? Going to grad school at some point? Are you wanting to do that? But that's going to cost more money. And, um... Let's also talk about Emerald's training. He's behind in his training, and now he's decided he's afraid of a vest. But he is doing better on that, so yay. And don't forget that you don't vlog enough, and that you are disappointing people. So all that going to my head, and the only thing I could think of was to just binge, which I don't do very often. It's very rare if I binge. It's terrible, I know. So I went to the dollar store and I got like a two liter. I got a regular bottle of Coke. I got two boxes of candy and some ice cream and these frozen Cinnabon things, which were amazing. Got home and I shoved out three slices of pizza, had the Cinnabon things, drank my Coke. And now I'm waiting. My mind still wants me to go, 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 but my stomach's like, wait a minute. Let me sit and digest first. And some brain's like, okay, well, while we wait, let's talk about how screwed up your brain is today. Yeah. Um. So, I don't know. Ugh. I just feel like a total whirlwind of just... Ugh. And I don't know why. I think this just is like all this internal stress that like I'll think about it every now and again. Sometimes for revenge just all comes together and I'm just like... Ugh. And of course, why would my body try to cope with it in a positive manner? Yay! No, not really. Um, but I'm like, you know, there is worse coping methods than binging, but binging is not good either. Because, sorry if you guys see me going up and down and up and down. My arm's tired, so I'm resting it on my knee. Um, because I already have, like issues regarding my body image and my weight and I'm not feeling very confident I'm like I'm gonna gain more weight which is it hypothyroid or is it just because I'm fat and lazy I don't know so <sighs> brain what the crap <laughs> 